It's a great stretch. If you're having some neck pain or some trap pain, it's good to release that, especially if you do a back workout or a shoulder workout, right? Sometimes your neck gets tense. If you're someone that is working a lot on the computer all the time, it's a great stretch for that too, okay? So what you wanna do is you wanna take the towel, right? You wanna kinda of crumple it up like this so that it's long, okay? And then place it on the floor, okay? This exercise ideally works really well with the resistance band because I know most people don't have resistance bands at home. I'm gonna make you use a towel. The whole idea of this is you're gonna step on the towel, okay? And keep a nice tension in the towel, okay? Not so much that it's pulling you down, but to the point where you're gonna hold on to this with your hand here, right? And th this should pull your arm down. Okay, just this for a lot of people is gonna be very relieving. It's gonna to start to stretch out the trap and the neck muscle for them, right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna show you at a bit of an angle so you can see what's going on. So right here, we're gonna step on it, right? So now when I stand straight, I get a little pull. This towel is pulling my arm down. Now from here, from this position, what I want you to do is, I want you to grab your hand, okay? Put it on the side of your forehead here, your temple, and I want you to drive your elbow down this way, right across your body, okay? So from here, you can take a deep breath in and you're gonna pull. And see, my neck is kinda tight, so I'm stuck here, but you, you might be able to go lower. And you're just gonna breathe in here for about 10 to 15 seconds. And you start to see a nice release in your neck and your trap muscles here. So once 15 seconds are done, then what I want you to do, instead of putting your hand here, I want you to put your hand at the back of your temple, not uh, of your back of your head, not directly behind, but at an angle at, a, at the corner right here of your head. And then I want you to go in line with your elbow. So if you're putting it at the corner, go in line like an, at an angle like here this way, okay? Pull down this way. Instead of straight this way, now you're gonna come almost in line with your chest this way where your nipple is, okay? So you're here, you're gonna pull down this way. And now you're gonna get a bigger stretch in your back and in your, in your neck and your traps. And every time you breathe out, you'll notice I go lower. You see that? So that releases more and more of my neck muscle, my trap muscle. This is the position that most people are gonna find the most relieving, okay? And then the last position that I like to go through it is that putting your head directly behind, your hand directly behind your head and pulling your neck straight down this way. So I kind of hang out there in like 10 to 15 seconds on this side. Now already this side is feeling really loose, really nice and light. Now we're gonna do the other side. Right here, you step on your towel, make sure it's pulling you down, and pull across. Okay, now we're going to turn the head this way and pull this way. So feel free to hang out in this position a little longer if you feel the need to. I'm just doing it quickly just to show you. And then now we're gonna go straight ahead behind her head and go straight down. That's it guys. That's my number one stretch for any sort of tight neck and trap muscle, especially if you have any neck pain, especially if you are at an office setting or just working out really, really hard. If you get a chance, Please do share these videos with your family and friends. That would be a great way to pay me back. And I'll see you guys next time.